hey what's going on guys in this video i'm going to show you guys how to download eclipse in my previous video i have shown you guys how to compile and run a java program in terminal because if you are using mac or macbook you have to use terminal to run java code like text edit and terminal but here what we are going to do is we are going to download an application called eclipse uh, this will make everything easier like you don't have to run through terminal because in terminal like if you are doing this one text edit you don't see the errors you know if you have any errors in coding you don't see the errors but if you are doing with eclipse you will see the error right away uh, in the line okay that's why we download eclipse and run uh, practice java through that to download eclipse you have to go to eclipse.org type eclipse.org and you will end up in this page okay i type again eclipse dot org okay now once you have gone to this one you will see a download uh, button on the top corner click this button and then you will see this eclipse uh, 64 bit i downloaded this click download or uh, you will download i already downloaded and run ran this uh, you will see the eclipse dmg and run this one okay once you have downloaded and complete you will see this in uh, what is it called application or you can just search eclipse here eclipse and it will appear here okay eclipse is running okay launch loading now uh, once you have in this one create a new java project uh, i i just named this one as my name Taliban o t h okay finish Okay, module name create now once you are in uh, this one you can see uh, it's already coming like this but this is not uh, what we are gonna do like we have to in the whatever the thing you created you will see two files jre system library and also src we have to go to this src and right click and then click new one new and then click class once you have done that it will ask your name just put something i call this one as apple and then finish it's already there you can see apple.java that's a class created and once you are done with the class it will always start with public class apple like whatever the name you created okay uh, that's the beginning and then you have to do the coding and then it will run now let's see how to run a code like i have created something already apples i created apples and in this one i have this um, uh, let's see something else apples oh i will do that one in my next tutorial okay uh, this is just to show how to install how to install eclipse because uh, this will help you uh, really good if you are trying to learn java programming see you guys in my next tutorial see you guys on my next tutorial